What up, YouTube? Nate here from Thrift Dweller. Today on the channel, we are continuing with the recaps. Uh, for people who don't know, back in December, I took a little bit of a break from YouTube, but I kept vlogging things. I kept picking up things at the thrift store, and I just put them in boxes to save them for these videos right now. So you'll have to excuse my appearance. I just came home from work. I took a shower. But uh, so far, we have recapped December of 2021, and then January. We are at the beginning of February now. Um, until we can catch up to today. So t in today's vlog, we have a lot of toys. And I don't know anything about m the majority of these toys. I had to break it up into two parts. So, uh, you know, doo -doo 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 -doo, go back to, looks like two months ago, as of me recording this right now. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Hey, good morning, everybody. It is just after opening. They got some stuff here. Oh, there's some He-Man in there. Are you kidding me? Sweet. Okay, my phone is like no data or no data, no memory left because I haven't dumped it in a while. But I found all these wicked toys and now I'm inspired to do a... Uh, I got a lot of toys that I haven't uh, did a pickup video on yet. They're just sitting in a box waiting to, to be opened. So let's do that today, guys. Good morning. It's Nate here from Thrift Dweller. Man, it's like my second time here, and I, I keep finding more vintage toys. Look at this, some Jurassic Park in there, Kenner. Uh, DC Superpower. Dick Tracy. Look like a G.I. Joe, that's pretty good. Also got a bunch of clothes, but this is not a clothing channel. I've kind of decided to just show the clothing here and there, but not focus a lot of my, my videos on it. There's a lot of good channels that do that already. Check them out. Uh, that Dallas Thrifter, obviously the one that we will always recommend here on the channel. Anyways, yes. Now we will go home for show, unless I find more stuff here. Okay, last, last PS, PS. My wife found this over here on the wall. Yeah, is that like Terminator with gold? Honey, you still have the eyes. You still have a good eye. Good thing you didn't have an eye for me when we got married. Blurry vision to my advantage. Morning, everybody. It is a blizzard outside, but inside, we are looking good. Oh, yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Ooh. I don't know what that is, but let's just hold on to it for now. Assassin's Creed 2. That's pretty old, right? Let's just put it in the cart for now. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty blizzardy. There's not much people here today. That's a cool looking Blastoise. I don't know how old that is, but four bucks. Oh, oh my God. Yesterday we had a nice toy score. Toy score yesterday. It looks like there's still some trickle effect from it. Venom looks interesting. Six bucks though. Got some Bart Simpson in there. I think I'm saving those toys that I found yesterday for a uh, an unbagging with Noah. I'd love to pick him up one day and just go over all these old toys that I found. Okay. So, ooh. Well, <laughs> I was literally just about to move on. Oh, he's missing a lot of stuff though. 2004. Oh yeah, yeah, look at the price. No, 13 bucks for that? Not today, sir. All right. Oh <laughs> my giddy aunt. Look at that. Oh my giddy aunt. This is just mental.
That dinosaur looks very interesting. Oh my god. Today is a nice day. Look at the store. Not much people today because of a blizzard. So this is the majority of my thrifting now. I like a clothing. This is really sick actually, I like that. Ooh, starter. Starter makes it harder. Looks like more of a modern starter, but they're asking way too much. That's the problem with thrifting here. Uh, compared to like my friends in the States who get like $1, $2 clothes. Like, look at $17 they ask for a used sweater. Come on, right? Probably they know there's too many resellers like myself here. You want to know why I spend so much money on toys or how I can? It's because clothing game is hot right now, son. Talking like these kids. Morning, everybody. Happy Monday. I don't know how much time I have left on my phone here. Data's running low. But, uh, yeah, the fines continue. Look at this. Like a Rambo in there. And they got a nice little football turtle. I haven't seen that before, so... Whatever. I'll probably pick it up if I'm not buying anything else. It's pretty dead today in the store. There you go. Ah, uh, yeah. Wish me luck. Found this banger. That is nice, buddy. Woo! Okay, I made a rule that said no more plushies. Oh, man. I gotta get this plushie. So as you can see, this video, or this recap, is mostly based on toys. I've been saving these toys in this box for at least two months now, so I can do this recap video. I also have more toys behind me that I didn't even shoot picking up. So this is everything that I found in today's recap video from the end of January. A lot of toys. This was a very toy-heavy couple of days at the thrift store I showed you. get this out of the way first here beautiful Super Mario Sunshine uh, strategy guide a little wide look at that gorgeous and a little bit beat up probably because I had it in a box for a couple months little ding there little bins there in the interest of keeping this video concise if I don't know something I'm just gonna say I don't know and you guys can comment below and show me how much smarter how much more smart you are than i am how much more smarter you are than i sorry it's late i just got home from work like an hour ago <laughs> let's get to it uh five dollars everything is minus 20 percent off in this video so, there you go. look at i'm just a happy jolly mailman raw <laughs> that's pretty good actually twin monsters it looks like look at that I want to say these are the real Ghostbusters. 1986, Columbia Pictures, so yeah. Again, same thing with that, so that's pretty nice. For $5, was this worth it? Let me know in the comments below. $5.99 minus 20% off. I should have showed you what was in the bag here. Obviously, this is what got me. Is he a fake He-Man figure? Yeah. There's a whole bunch of these fake, fake He-Man stuff. Some of them are actually pretty collectible, I will say. But I don't know anything about this guy. Let me know in the comments below. Got gold dust over here. Who is this guy? He's not gold dust. I'm just kidding. Oh, it's a 1992 Kenner figure. You got uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger as the King of Rome. I have no clue. You can hear that a lot in this video. Creed Nate just spent a lot of money on things he didn't know what they were, including this guy right here. So for $5.99. Was this worth it? Let me know in the comments below. What does this guy mark this? 1995 McFarlane Toys. Yeah, he looks like a McFarlane toy. Kind of works. Whatever. Whatever. $5.99 minus 20% off. This looks like the bad guy from... What's that movie again with Arnold? Shoot, I'm blanking right now. There he is. We got this homeboy. 
Is it Marvel 1993's? I see 93 Toy Biz. Who is this guy? I should know who this is. It's Marvel. These guys look super sick, right? There you go. Noah would know who that is. We'll make a red over here. Looks like he's missing his tentacle things. And you got a yellow guy here. This one feels a little weak. $5.99 minus 20% off. Yeah, this one felt a little on the weaker side. $5.99 minus 20% off. This one just had a really cool venom in it. Here, a little bit of White Ranger action. That's pretty cool. How old is this guy? 95. Look at that. Boom. Probably Burger King toy. Yeah, that's going to go back to being donated. Put all the donation stuff over there. And a really cool Venom figure who looks like he's sitting, he's supposed to be sitting on something. Yeah, what does Venom look like when he's taking a deuce? Anyways, this one was $5.99 minus 20%. What was this one? A waste of money. Let me know in the comments below. That's donation. Ooh, Nelly. $3.99. Oh, that's a good deal. Wow.